Good morning. This is a how-to maintenance on the Marini MR2 PN8. Here's the MR2 PN80 with some minor modifications by a client. This is the control panel. Pretty basic. Two cords coming in and out of your rotary. And two coming out of your feed motor down below. Feed motors at the bottom of the mast. Rotary slides up and down the mast. Feed motor, gearbox, rotary. And here's your flushing hose. Which comes right in here to the end of the column. And your main air feed from your compressor comes into the other end of your control column. This is your emergency shutoff switch. I have it shut off right now. Pressure gauge and control panel. Um, these two guys control your feed and rotary up and down. Pretty simple. If you want them the other way, just switch the hoses. This is a safety valve, which prevents you from overcrowding with the rotary and lifting the rig. You can adjust it, plus or minus. It can also be used as a feed control for coring through rock, so you don't have to hold it the entire time. It has a plastic cap. As you can see, it's just a square piece of plastic down here. It's the one part you can screw up and, and strip. So once you put it back on, you just twist it left and right. Just hand twist. Doesn't take much. And then should you completely screw this up, you can always bypass here. So, now I've got it running through the control, and now I don't. Now I'm bypassing the air. Other than that, there's only a couple things to do on this rig. This is <clears throat> your air filter, and this is your inline oiler. You can see the oil dripping through right here. Should be one drip every three seconds. And if you're running a drifter, more often, probably double. Um, this guy here is how you fill the oil. It is a brass fitting. And your oil goes right into the tank there. If you get sediment in your oil, you can always remove the entire reservoir by pressing and turning, just as it tells you to do, and the reservoir comes right off. Here's your oil. One thing to be careful about is this container is glass and theoretically might be broken but we've never heard of anybody breaking it. So, other than that, pretty simple. Nothing much to break. And that's the MR2 PN80. Enjoy.